So I guess, uh, I guess that wasn't true. We could push in the end, but only because they were pretty stupid. Our enemies. Oh, updated equipment. Oh, new planes. Very nice. All right, because we took over the entire Polish arsenal. Right, that is great. So that is going to definitely help in the fight in the Caucasus. All right, Are about we have completely flanked their army. Oh, the United States of America has declared war on the Philippines. Hello there, you hear you long. What the hell are you doing? Okay, sure. Uh, how very interesting. So foreign policy, they went to defend the interior. As opposed to defend the border. Deal with Panama. So they still haven't gone... Okay, the American Phoenix looking outwards. Restored new democratic bastion. A question of foreign holdings. Okay, so they, they did that. Okay. Uh, America's getting more powerful. That's interesting to see. I uh, can't wait for the Polish SSR to really start to pump out the divisions. Because they do have quite the territory. Now, we have murdered a lot of Polish in our war, so... Can't really expe expect too much, really, but... Hey, that's fine. I wonder if they took the Georgian battleship. <laughs> no, they haven't done the mighty Georgian battleship. Aww. Ain't that so sad? Oh, revive Transcaucasia. They didn't form Transcaucasia. Oh no, they, did, they kinda did. These are the dominions of Georgia. How interesting. Mm, can we take Yerevan? No, we cannot. But we can maybe sever their territory. Damn it. Looks like we ourselves are getting severed. Oh, he's moving out of Yerevan. The fool! Pop that last stand, please. Alright. However, Georgia has sent a lot of troops to help out their allies, and that has left pretty few divisions defending Georgia itself, so yeah, that's making it really easy for us. So we clear up the Sochi pocket now, and go for Batumi. Oh, come on. Save our boys. Ah, uh, they're gonna die. Ah, uh, well, the Erevan dream was never to be. However, we have basically taken over most of western Georgia. So I guess we can do this. Oh, damn it. Huh. <laughs> the mighty Georgian battleships may not have been here, but the mighty Georgian destroyers were. However, they did not destroy much. They were themselves destroyed. Yeah, while the Georgians are causing us heavy casualties with 35k already dead, uh, they have taken themselves heavy, heavy damage, and I don't really see them being able to hold indefinitely. Oh, the Deutschen Reich has declared war on the state of Czechs. So that's 
pretty bad, but hey, no nothing really out of the ordinary. Hey, they're holding. Have they fortified Sudetenland? No. That's a bad idea, so they didn't hold for very long. Rhineland, the friend of... Okay, so the Germans are getting bigger. My hope is that they go after the West first. Rather than us. Um, now... Eastern European outreach. Yeah, they, they bypass those because, you know, we've already murdered them. However, thankfully, it seems like the strike the Soviet Union thing, they cannot do it. Oh no, they require one of the following, but they don't have one million people. Okay. And yeah, like the, okay, so the Finnish friends thing is what I'm not liking. The Finnish friends thing is what I'm not liking. And alliance with Sweden, I also do not like. So... I'd rather take these people down before anything else. Alright, go for Baku now. And okay, so our political power is getting back up, so we can finally get things rolling on the political front. Oh, Yerevan is open. How good. How great. How amazing. Okay, so the justification is complete for the Japanese. Actually... Okay, now that half of you are here. Full execution, declare war. Let's go. Also, need to get on Sakhalin. And oh look, you have 11 divisions there, man. How could it be? How could it be? Oops, seems like you're screwed. Go for Vladivostok, boys. We will recover the Far East. For the proletarian revolution. Okay, so we did take Baku, however, it seems like it seems like our troops there were surrounded, which is fine, we're gonna survive on Baku. That's a defensible location. And uh, we are destroying these people. Now obviously since they don't have any sea actual sea connections to the east over here, uh, doesn't matter if they have ports, they're gonna starve here. Because the supply flow right now is coming from Tbilisi, I think. And Tbilisi is not really able to give them anything right now. What? Okay. Finally. There goes the Czech state, and there goes Georgia. Excellent. Very good, the mighty Soviet Union has brought the joys of socialism to the Caucasus. That is good. Uh, this gives us yet another front on the Germans, on the Valkists. Like, however, I don't think that anything other than Damn it. 
other than something like this, is really required. Twelve divisions, some of whom are mountaineers. The rest can go reinforce the other armies. However, actually, that's... Uh, what kind of divisions are you made of? Okay, you're not as good as mine. So I guess I can make you a separate kind of army group. Under Meretsov. Gonna guard East Prussia. Because this should be a relatively simpler assignment. While everyone else is uh, assigned to the more difficult fronts. Alright, how's Japan looking? We have taken Vladivostok. Very good. So now we go after Korea, and yeah, these Japanese divisions are now without supplies. You stand here and guard Vladivostok itself. Oh, Toyohara here is without troops. So we can we can seize that. Oh, of course they have naval landed. And uh, Magadan and Akhotsk. But, I mean, what are they going to do? I'm just gonna pull off five divisions and fight them off. But it's like, you know, this is relatively remote Japan. You really aren't gonna do anything useful there. TBH. TBH. I'd rather have Korea than that. I'd rather have Korea. Because Korea sounds actually useful. Apparently that's not what the Japanese were thinking. Which fills me up with joy. Because that means I get Korea for free. Which is even better. Alright, need new industry tech. We have reached that moment in the game. Kingdom of the Netherlands. Wait, Kingdom of the Netherlands, does that mean that... No, it's this one. No, wait, that's the Dutch state. Oh, right. Right. I forgot that you existed. Hilarious. Alright, uh, need to repair this infrastructure in the Far East. Right, I do still have this cavalry horde. Uh, I'm gonna put them at Mongolia's border. And uh, the revolution in Mongolia. Oh, whoa, they have a lot of units. I was not expecting them to have a massive army. TBH. But oh well. Oh, the Turkish state has just kicked off the Second Great War. Because the Hellenic Republic is guaranteed by the Brits, and the Turkish state has the Stalpot, so that's going to bring in everybody. Although, apparently, the German Reich had, uh, had a city in Albania, Vlore, or Vlo... 
Vlaria. Probably because the Italians had it. And so, yeah. Valona. <laughs> I'm just gonna use the Italian name. Valona. That's what that place is called. In Italian. Right, we can take some traits on our generals. That's probably not the worst idea ever. Yeah, spent all my command power. Alright, Japan. How are you gonna feel once we destroy you? Uh, you put a lot of divisions here. Apparently four of them. Uh, four of your twelve divisions are here. Uh, more than four, actually, because you've got other guys coming in. From Magadan. Yeah. We destroyed the Japanese on land. Oh, here's more Japanese. Yeah, we've declared war on the Mongols. This might be a terrible idea. Although it doesn't seem like their units are actually good. Good, because, you know, they have a million of them, so... Not have not them not having that many is good, um, right? Uh, what I could do to make this a whole lot easier on us is to give my cavalry army some air support. You know, aircraft plus plus cavalry equals good. It looks like South America is gonna be gonna be kicking 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 off. All right, the Soviet hordes are swarming through Korea. Very good. Very great. Oh, looks like. Uh, it looks like in Magadan, they, they've tried to resist this, but that's seven divisions down the drain for the Japanese dogs. So I guess uh, the battle for the Sea of uh, Japan has begun. I'm gonna still keep this 24 division army to the, in the Far East, you know, just in case. Assigned on various garrison duties, but still around. Because you, you never know about the Far East. Excellent. Seven Japanese divisions dead. Great, we're done with that. Uh, do we really get any bonuses from here? No, we don't. But with the aircraft tree, I guess we do. So, yeah. Get that as well. Alright, the Mongols, we can advance back on them now. No. What I want you to do is that. Alright, come on, air support. Please tell me that you're worth your... You're worth your salt. Oh no! The Mongols have surrounded my infantry. 
or sorry, not my infantry, my cavalry. Right, I mean, I guess this is this is what you are for. No, no, please, please do please. please. Don't want like 17 million divisions coming out here to the northeast because there's no need. Like the Japanese here are gonna die on their own. Yeah, they're they're definitely dying on their own. You stay there as a garrison for Magadan. Doesn't look like the air force is actually helping any. 